good. Backing up, ten four six. Good. Advancing ten four nine. Ten. Ten four six. Good. Don't forget the slash as you zone out. Okay, try it again. Four nine. Good. Backing up, ten four six. Ten. Yeah, as you zone out. Good. Yeah. Again. Ten. Four. It's all right. Go on. Good. Backing up. Ten four six. Nice. Again, one more time. Good. Good. One more time. Ten four nine. Good. Backing up ten four six. Nice. Okay, um, I have to do a voice over here because you can't really hear me. I'm showing here what's called the Trampilia concept in the close range. Trampilia means trap door. And the reasoning behind this is to bait the live hand of your opponent. So, if you think about a trap door, the trap door is closed when you block. So you'll see here, um, when I strike, he blocks, the trap door is closed, he opens it and presents either a roof, and right there, I fell through the trap, I, f I fell through some branches, which are his strikes, and then I fall onto spikes, which are his thrusts. So the trap door is closed, the trap door is open, he's presenting a roof. You could, you could either present a roof or a shield. Here he's presenting the roof. I fall through the branches, okay, and then his thrust as a finishing move. So why are we doing this? Well, it's it's to change the game up a little bit. Uh, the tendency is to automatically, once he's grabbed that stick, I can't bring bring it back for defense, is to jam that hand. He knows this, so he's going to play around with that, uh, sort of that tendency. Here he's presenting, presenting the shield, and then he's going to zone out and strike, and then finishing move will be a thrust. So this is a Trampilia concept in the close range. There is a, a Trampilia concept in the um, um, long range, but we're just covering it in the short range here. Now why is it, why do we present the roof and the shield? Well, it's to present more options for the opponent to grab to. So if he'll either grab the stick, here I'm just showing you the grabs to the wrist or to the hand, um, but you're presenting uh, anything for him to grab onto. You want to bait that live hand to either grab onto my stick, um, my wrist, my hand, or even punch me. Okay. So I've, I've fell through the trap there, fell through some branches, which are strikes again. Okay. So this concept is um, it's pretty uh, basic. We're just showing a different way of baiting the live hand in the close range. Alright, thanks a lot.